you could just this, this isn't filled you could pour any content it could be for anything caramel hazelnut any type of uh, any type of coffee syrups it could have a pump on two or no pump at all it could be all pour this one is a pour so basically four contents in one say you like all flavored coffee flavors you could have you could get them all in one container and it's about two cups in each right and then again like you could actually put a pump on each one or whatever you'd like so there you go and when you're done you could actually rinse the uh, pressure sensitive containers out and, and refill them with anything else you'd like to fill them with like I say you can use this over and over again for different uh, purposes and if there's French vanilla in here you could actually unscrew it or unsnap it and the remaining French vanilla you could just take it and get every last drop out by just squeezing along the pressure sensitive container. So this is just another variation of what you could do and then you could just place this back in your refrigerator or wherever you want. Some, some do not require a refrigeration depending what it is. This could be oil, vinegar, different type of oil, different type of vinegar, basically anything. This is, we were supposed to show you this with the condiments, but they were over on the other end and didn't get a chance. So I'll just place this right here for now. Here's something else. It's actually put in plastic where this could be just uh, recharged. Here you go. This is just for apple juice, orange juice, it's not, it's not filled, or grape juice. So there you go. Pour that right in as much as you want. You have your grape juice. You have your orange juice, and you have your apple juice. And basically, this is just a container that we 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 we, we took and uh, put the holes in there, and then used our self-tapping tight pressure-sensitive containers. You notice it's very very tight. They're tight right in there. They don't move. And what's nice about this, you could also if you like, you could also pour, if you had the cup, you actually could pour apple juice and orange juice, if it's a decent sized cup, at the same time. They would dispense right down, and then again, if you chose, you could also do orange juice and grape juice in any combination. And like I say, if we wanted to, we could actually, this was a larger container, and it did have this handle on it, we could actually put four or more across. It's just that would be, in this case, if it was a larger container, it would have the same amount of content in our pressure sensitive container. If it was a, uh, another size, we, whatever the size the container is, we could adjust our pressure sensitive containers to match the content within or more or less. So basically, again, say this is this size and you like chocolate milk, you could put or strawberry, or vanilla, whatever syrup you want in here. It don't have to have pumps. You know that you could have uh, half a cup, eight ounces of chocolate that you could pour out, and skim milk, or uh, whole milk, or almond milk, regular milk, whatever you want to do in any combination. Then you could write down on here exactly what's in the what's in the container. This way you have everything in one, and it's just simplifies the task and at the same time still being environmentally friendly because this thing is you always will keep this and you will just replace as needed less of the plastic and again this could be made we have ones that we did made made a little notch and you and you could it is made completely of cardboard and it's exactly the same so either or now these little pieces of plastic just put aside for now all right so there you go and oh i see one other one other container various oils etc so this actually is is, uh, is corn oil uh, we put in here this is corn oil oil 